She served faithfully on operations for 27 years, but today HMS York returned home to Portsmouth for the last time. One of the Royal Navy's last Type 42 destroyers, she will be decommissioned on the 27th of September and replaced by the new Type 45 class. Tim Cooper was there to see her final return. The guns of Fort Blockhouse in Gosport gave a traditional welcome home to HMS York before the ship began the very last mile of the 750,000 she steamed during an illustrious career. Hundreds of well-wishers took time to watch the graceful destroyer come home for the final time. Flags in the dockyard said welcome home, and it must certainly have been a time of mixed emotions for the ship's company who lined the deck. HMS York entered service with the Royal Navy in 1985. Several tours of the Gulf in the 90s culminated with a frontline role providing fire support for HMS Ark Royal in the 2003 Iraq War. She's been at the front line of humanitarian work as well, only last year helping rescue British subjects from Benghazi in strife-torn Libya. Eventually, though, the journey is at an end and she's tied up in Portsmouth. Decommissioning will come next week and eventually disposal. Her current and last commanding officer is Commander Rex Cox. Of course, it's the people that make a ship, and we have a strong bond as a team. Team York is a strong team. Uh, and uh, we will miss uh, serving with each other when we move on to different, different ships. But uh, I think we should reflect on, on everything she has achieved uh, and look to the future. You know, she's being replaced by a new Type 45, far more capable. HMS York will be officially decommissioned next week, meaning the time of the Type 42s in the Royal Navy is all but at an end. Just one will remain in service now. That's HMS Edinburgh. She deploys on Monday to the South Atlantic. Tim Cooper, Forces News, Portsmouth.